and uh, you know, he was always winning contests for sales for his car company. And so he asked me what kind of a camera I need wanted. So I said 16 millimeter, which turned out to be a very stupid mistake because the film was extremely expensive. And um, I should have gotten a smaller one. But anyway, and the problem is, I don't know where. I was driving with somebody. We must have been going to a convention in Ohio. So this is this was the and first 19, time you used this camera. This is my very first picture taken with the new camera. <laughs> oh my gosh. And I've taken some of these out. I've put them in another. My very first picture with the new 16 millimeter camera. Are you going to do something about there, that? There, you got it. There you go. Oh, look how Okay, fall. this was in Cambridge City, Indiana, just as we were leaving Indiana on the border of Ohio. And um, this is Lake Arena in Cleveland. Well, we must have been going to the convention at Cleveland then. Mm -hmm. And that was the... Went to a, a home economics convention. What year? 1952. October of 1952. So we're in Cleveland. That was probably the convention center. You're supposed to pan from left to right. And I did do it right sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, there I am. Oh. Somebody else took my picture. Don't you look pretty? That was a coat I made. You I made actually coat? made that. And I made a hat to match it, but I didn't have it on. <laughs> I see. And this is a football game in Terre Haute in November. I don't know who was playing. <laughs> and this is me in Indianapolis in slow motion. <laughs> Yeah, that's my coat that I made. You made that. What a gorgeous outfit. Look I how think that you was. Are. Boy, isn't that pretty? Yeah. And there's the fellow I know that <laughs> <laughs> at Ohio and Pennsylvania. Say gosh, Bernard. He, gosh, he was it's a good, good looking, man. wasn't he? Mm -hmm. <laughs> and Christmas fifty two, the little Carol and Billy, <laughs> and that must probably was in Terre Haute, wasn't it? Mm-hmm. There's back that chance, you remember the, yeah. <laughs> that, see, I hadn't had the camera very long, and the, I would take, get it out, and the kids would just stand there yeah. waiting. To, and so I say, let's do something. Uh -huh. <laughs> so there did something. <laughs> Carol and her dolly. That's on 10th Street. Uh -huh. And that's our house. There's no... Yeah, that's going out the back door. On fourth? Mm-hmm. Mother's dressed up in her fur. Mm, looks pretty. And Bill, Carol and Bill, and a new bike, and, and Bucky. Oh, my goodness. What kind of a car is that? Ford. And Bill's taking down his Christmas lights. <laughs> Where is that? Um, 10th that. Street? I didn't know that porch was enclosed. And there's little Michael, I guess. Mm -hmm. Must be little Mikey. <laughs> and his mama, Norma, isn't that a pretty picture of her? Mm -hmm. And mother always had, and dad, yeah, that's the 10th Street house. And that, I took them leaving the house and arriving home. <laughs> <laughs> Carol. Oh, that was a pretty coat. Mm -hmm. That was uh, Look at that gorgeous scarf. gray flannel. Yeah. And Betty Jane looks like she's out, out by her house. Yeah. She's pretty. She had the prettiest skin. Mm -hmm. I don't know where those were. I've kind of taken so many things out of here, I've lost track of what this is. But. 
Betty and her mother and dad. Hattie and Russell Alley. Oh, that must have been Easter. Mm -hmm. uh, better. And Edna and some people from our church. Oh. Mm -hmm. Oh, Merle. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I've just taken the church. Oh, my. It was Riley Church, Riley Methodist Church, and it was, there was a there was a date on there, Betty Jane, and Mrs. Daly, and there's Michael, I guess, and Bucky. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Pull up your socks, kid. <laughs> <laughs> and there's Billy. Mm -hmm. That's it. And then Billy's climbing the tree. Hattie's hyacinths back there. The Dodge and Forsythia. It was Easter. And then Aunt Bertha and Carol Aww. promenading. And this is our class reunion we had at Deming Park in the spring of 1953. Betty and we tried to get everybody together because this was really our 50th anniversary. I think, and uh, see, we just had reunions every other year, so no, this wasn't it, and that wasn't that. Uh, it wouldn't have been 50. Uh, no, it wasn't 50. It was just a reunion. It was a, we hadn't been uh, out of school very long, and we had kind of wanted to get together, and I don't think those are the children of, now that is a girl I taught school with in Broad Ripple, and those are her children. She was an English teacher. <laughs> She had a puppy. Yeah, uh, more than one. <laughs> yeah, they lived down near Southport. Uh, uh, we used to go, uh, Bernard and I used to go there, visit on Sunday. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Aren't you cute? <laughs> look, he's got matching shorts. Yeah, these, there's these shorts. Oh, look at those socks. Aren't those <laughs> socks something? <laughs> look how skinny I was. Yeah. <laughs> no, that's not the picture I remember, but. We were down at Kentucky Lake with this couple. Um, I forget, her name was uh, Barbara too. And Matt, Man, his name was Manford. Bernard worked with him. The well, four of us went down there to Kentucky Lake and we had this one big, you know, that's the other girl. We had this. Uh, you always look like a fashion plate. Yeah, don't I'm I I'm surprised don't. you were not a model, <laughs> that somebody didn't pick you up as a model. We were driving along. Yeah, the other girl's named Barbara, too. We were shopping at the village. We stayed in this building. It was one great big room, and uh, the bunk beds were on each side. So we all slept in the same room. Oh, no. And, and we cooked, I guess. I don't remember the, I guess we went shop, went in the, in the lake. This was um, TBA Dam down there. We were in the village at a beach house. I'll tell you. This is an oil well that Bernard had money in. He took me to see it. It was in Illinois. It did not pan out. It didn't? I don't think so. <laughs> Poor Bernard. First the oil, I, the I used to have a core, the, the, uh, the, the uh, core of a, a limestone core that came out of there. Oh, I, yeah? I think I left it in Indianapolis. But, you know, I went to Iowa State to a, and I remember the beautiful point, uh, petunias. I never thought they were very pretty, but they in, a, in a big bunch they are. I went to a uh, some kind of a workshop with Elsie. That's Elsie. She worked in the Southwest Branch office, and I worked, or she worked in the Southeast Branch office. She and I went to this workshop on, it was very hot, but it was pretty, pretty campus. I think that was 1953. And this is my friend Connie and, no, her mother and dad, uh, pals, and um, Lee and Lynn, Connie's children, but where's Connie? Well, she's in there someplace. He worked for Sinclair Oil. Oh, there's Connie. She and I were very dear friends. She's a little bit older than I, and when I lived out in Raleigh. I used to stay with her a lot when I went to college. We were sorority sisters. Oh, she yeah. lived up in Logansport. <laughs> I never remember I, I saw her children. There's Bernard working on the Cleaning car. Cleaning up the car. Washing the station wagon. I wonder whose station wagon that was. <laughs> never did 
I to have his picture taken. Really? No, he didn't. He's so good looking. Probably squirt me with it. And this is, I don't know who. Oh, that's, um, I, um, Bernard bought that house down south. That's another investment. And I had money in it too, which we finally sold it. But we went down to see them and that was their family. And uh, it was on Mooresville Road. He, I think he bought it to rent or something. Mm. I can't remember how that turned out. He always had these deals mm. <laughs> that I got roped in on. <laughs> and um, this is Purdue vs. Notre Dame, 7 to 37, October 53. Well, I do remember going up to Purdue with them a couple of times. But boy, they've added so much to the, you know, they've built up higher seats now, mm -hmm. much bigger. And this is the ISTC homecoming parade in 1953. Ah, yeah, there's Fannie Mae Kane. Downtown. We used to never miss it. What year was it? 1953. The sororities all had to uh, make the floats. I never got involved in that because I started the second semester. <laughs> mm. What sorority were you in? Kappa Kappa. It was not national. They went national, and I didn't I didn't join. After I got out of school, I didn't. It, didn't, it wasn't that important to me. My mother was a Kappa, so they had to take me. <laughs> <laughs> and it was nice when you were in school, you know, you had a big sister that kind of looked after. Uh -huh. We had good parties. <laughs> this was before the sororities went national. William Tell. Well, they're kind of fancy, aren't they? Mm -hmm. Really fancy. Do they still do that? No. <laughs> Looks like a lot of work. Yeah, look at them move. That and everything. really, oh my goodness. Whoa. My gosh. They must have had to take a shower. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Okay.